Star Trek employees delivering their message. When I say union, you say power. Union, power. Union, power. Union, power. Union, power. Union, power. They're the big blue trucks getting your parcel from store to door. But today, workers slammed on the brakes. Union, power. Two thousand Star Trek employees across the country walking off the job in a 24-hour protest over job security. Workers concerned about their future employment. The work has been taken from them and pushed to lower standards. That's not something the Australian community wants to see. The TWU says competitions forced Star Trek to source cheaper labour through external companies up to two-thirds of the work in some yards. Workers want their futures secured. You just to know that, you know, at the end of the day, we have a job. We're not going to be losing our job to outside hire. Some 50 to 70 per cent of all work is contracted out to other companies that have got lower terms and conditions. What do we want? Job security! security. Do we want it now? Workers are fighting for job security, concerned outsourcing will leave them jobless. Jonathan Prickett has worked at the Dara Sheds for five and a half years. It's going nowhere at this point in time. So, you know, we, we, want, we want this job security. You know, we want to know that we've got a job that, to, to come to every day. The union says it's concerned about job security and is calling for three things. It wants the company to guarantee labour hire will be paid the same as regular employees. It wants caps on hiring contractors and wants assurances employees will be offered the work before it is contracted out. It's just a reluctance from the company to employ directly because they're trying to cut, cut wages and, and do it on the cheap. The Transport Workers Union National Secretary Michael Caine says standards are being driven down due to an Amazon effect. He said Star Trek's management were toying with workers' livelihoods at the same time as workers were under intense pressure to deliver record volumes of parcels. Transport companies across the board are making these job security attacks because uh, they are being squeezed by retailers and they're being squeezed by new models like Amazon Flex which are breaching the law and the federal government is nowhere to be seen to regulate this market to make sure there's a level playing field. If it was simply law that if you're doing the same job, it's the same pay, you can't just outsource it at a cheaper rate uh, to labour hire, then workers would not be in a situation where they have to strike to try to achieve something that's pretty fundamental and pretty clear to most people that it's fair. Thousands of FedEx workers are set to walk off the job next week. The announcement just a day after Star Trek drivers went on strike. The Transport Workers Union says the industrial action is being taken as part of a push for protections against outsourcing. I wanted to bring the solidarity of the whole trade union movement to you for this fight. Your cause that you're fighting for, for job security, is a just cause. It's something that's worth fighting for and the whole trade union movement is uniting behind that same cause. We are with you on this fight for job security. We're calling Star Trek um, on, on a Senate inquiry, um, job security Senate inquiry, to explain to the Australian public on why they have the position they have and the consequences of that position. And just remember this, when you stand together you win and we will win this battle. What do we want? Job security! When do we want it? Yeah!